everybody so I am back today today is March 20th excuse that weird like noise that went on in my mouth just there um so today's video is going to be an empties video and I just kind of want to get a couple things out before I start this video because tomorrow is trash day recycle day so what better day would it be to film my empties video a day before it has to go out to the road. Um, if you guys are wondering what is on my lips, I am wearing just the Kim Kardashian West and Kimberly. Super gorgeous color. Um, I have not worn this line in a minute so I decided why not wear it today and excuse my hair I just got out of the shower and one other thing I wanted to go over with really quick is this foundation um <clears throat> I did read a couple things that I forgot to leave or put in the review video this is an anti-aging um, and it says foundation. that it also had a built-in primer with it so today what I decided to do was to go ahead and try my elf primer with this foundation and you guys this is only one coat and I'm actually really satisfied with the way of the coverage with um the primer plus only one pump of this it's not too much foundation and it actually leaves your face looking natural which i like so my thoughts on this foundation has probably changed with the primer one coat and bam you are pretty much covered you look like you're awake you look like you're alive so I would definitely recommend this to someone if you guys can get your hands on it. I do know it's a clearance item, so I don't know if Walmart still has them right now. All right, so with further ado, let's go ahead and get into this empties video. Um, the first thing that I emptied is, and I'm going to kind of do like little reviews. I'm not going to like keep going with the situation. I get my coffee out of the damn way. All right, so the first thing that I emptied is just this Unstoppables by um, Downey I believe and Febreze is the scent added and then it is Shimmer. I really like this. It smells really good and it says it lasts up to six hours which it does not. So that is probably one thing that I will not be repurching this because um, it does have a nice scent but also the scent does not last as long as it states and um, it is kind of pricey for just a little thing to like get scents down in the bathroom. The next thing I emptied is bounce fabric sheets. I just like use these on a spur because I wanted to try something new. I like these. I just feel like it doesn't make your clothes soft and I feel like the scent does not attach it to the clothes as well as like my downy fabric sheets that I like to use. Alright the next thing I emptied is just a good old Dollar Tree Crest 3D White Toothpaste. I emptied a Bath and Body Works French Lavender Gentle Foaming Hand Soap. I am finally getting down to the last nitty bitty of my hand soaps to where I can go buy more. I'm so excited, you guys. The next thing I emptied is um, just a Dove Dry Oil Soap Bar. And holy crap, you guys, I used to only use the white Dove Bar Soap because I felt like it had the best scent and all this crap. And this, this right here um, was marked down at my store for like three dollars for a 12 pack and normally it's like seven dollars i was like holy crap i'm grabbing that but um this seriously feels like you do not need to use body wash because it's so smoothing and it leaves your skin just i don't know it just feels like you can just feel the moisturizing working as you're lathering it onto your skin it's really weird 
Alright, the next thing I emptied is just the scent Sensationals from Walmart. And this is in the scent Rock Candy. And this is just um, the wax melts. This stuff smells so good, you guys. Mm, it smells like legit candy. Like, when you are burning it, I swear, it, it just smells like... <sighs> It smells like heaven. That's all I can say. All right. So I emptied a 500 count cotton swab just from Walmart. So nothing too fancy with that. I emptied a saline solution for sensitive eyes, which I do not use this for contact solution purposes. I use this for um, my piercings and how I clean my piercings. All right, the next thing I emptied is this grape seed face mask that I did a review on you guys and I'm actually blown away by this I really enjoyed this I have one more that I'm going to be using quite soon I can't wait because I really fell in love with um, that stuff just some more toothpaste all right the last four items and I kind of want to elaborate on. Right. So the last thing I emptied, or a couple last things I emptied, is this Ultra Shine from the Dollar Tree. And you guys, I was very scared of even buying this because I was in so much need of um, dish soap. And I just like, whatever, just grab it. So the first time I ran my washer machine, or my dishwasher, um, I had only put one tab in there and I'm sitting there I was like oh my god is this gonna clean it because I'm a type of person that I just rinse my stuff off with like my soap squeegee thing and then I just throw it in there I don't like actually scrub anything and like hand wash it and then put it in there um, I'm like is this really going to so I ran the thing and when I it got done, I opened it up and I noticed that there was white stuff all over my dishes. And then I noticed that my dishes did not smell very pleasant. They still kind of smelt dirty. And so I'm like, well, let's try it again with two tabs. It seemed like it helped a little bit more with the two tabs. But... It just still felt like my dishes were coming out st um, like really stinky. And um, one other or two other things I notice about this product is it does not dry your dishes to save your life. Like once it goes through the dry cycle, most of the time it should be dried. This crap, I had to hand dry everything that was coming out of my dishwasher so I don't recommend that and another thing I did notice is you know how your hands are wet and you're going in and you're grabbing them out to stick in your dishwasher they stuck like I only probably used four out of this whole bag and the rest of them just like clumped together and then they started ripping open I would not recommend this no I wouldn't even recommend that to anybody no all right, the next thing I emptied is the Salon Selective from the Dollar Tree as well. Now, this does have pros and cons. Um, the cons, I don't really think that it helped with your hair. Like, I used this three times because I have a lot of hair, so I have to use a lot of conditioner. And, um... I got three uses out of this, so I don't really know, like, if this is something that you can really go on and say that you can actually review this, but I actually feel like it made my hair very coarse. It felt like, the hell, it felt like, um, my hair was completely damaged, like, I did not know how to take care of my hair. And it seriously felt like straight up horse hair when I used this. And now the thing that I did like about this is it had a very good scent for being a dollar. Right, the last two oh. items that I emptied are perfume bottles. And that is because I am trying to get rid of my older perfumes so I can 
kind of be like, hey, I need some more perfume. <laughs> so I used up finally, you guys. I've had this forever. And that is Snooky by Nicole. I don't know how to pronounce her last name. I just love this packaging. Now, I am a type of person that um, saves perfume bottles. But just because this is cheetah print and it's just like so overrated and crap like that, I just don't know if I'm going to keep it just because I really did not like this right here. I think if she would have just left it all cheetah and then with her heart, I think it would have been a lot cuter. But this right here is throwing me off. Um, this had a... I don't know this had like a fruit scent I don't really remember because I threw everything away because I've had this perfume forever but it smells like really fruity and I really loved it um when I wore this a lot, I got a lot of compliments people are like oh what are you wearing girl and I'm like Snooky they're like who's that because I live in a um time error county where people aren't with the times uh, <laughs> I am legit, you guys. Alright, the next um, perfume that I emptied is by Katy Perry. And this is her Purr collection. And this bottle I am definitely keeping just for the simple fact because it is a cat. And you all know I love cats. I am a crazy cat lady. So this is definitely going to be saved. It's probably going to go on my um, filming vanity desk now this perfume holy shit you guys you did not have to spray a lot because just smelling it, it is so fucking potent it smells like overly powerful baby powder that's exactly what this smells like and i remember um when i would wear this to work People would start coughing and shit as I'm walking by. I'm like, damn, my perfume don't stink that bad. They're like, no, it don't stink. It's very strong and very potent because everybody knows, oh, excuse me, that I wear perfume. So that is everything that I emptied for this month of March, half of February. I just film my empties whenever because I had to get the stuff out to the trash this week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big, huge thumbs up. And I hope to see you guys very soon in my next video. And don't forget to comment, subscribe 100% free, and I will see you guys very soon in my next video. See you guys.